us today to look at the causes of the First World War. Um, we all know that the First World War began in the year 1914 and ended in the year 1918. It involved 135 countries from around the world and estimated 15 million people lost their lives. So this is the war that saw the introduction of the sophisticated weapons that we have around today. This includes things like battleships, submarines, fighter jets, and poisonous gas, among others. The causes of the First World War are as follows. The immediate cause of the First World War is um, the assassination of Franz Archduke Ferdinand, who was an heir to Austria-Hungary. He was assassinated in Sarajevo alongside um, his fiancée, Sophie, by a 19-year-old Gavrilo Princip. The second cause of the First World War is imperialism. So imperialism is a policy where the European nations were trying to extend their power and influence through colonization. The competition for colonies is actually what led to rivalism between the European nations and at the end of the day we had the first world war. Uh, the third cause is a systems of alliance. There were two antagonistic blocks in Europe. These uh, led to suspicion and fear. The two main blocks were um, the triple alliance which comprised of German, Austria-Hungary and Italy. The second block was uh, the triple entente alliance which comprised of France, um, France, France, Russia, and and also Britain. So these two blocks were opposing each other in the sense that where a member was attacked by an opponent from another alliance, the whole block would then move to protect that member. So at the end of the day, we had the World War. Um, the fourth cause was economic rivalism among the European powers. The European nations sought to expand their territory through imperialism, as we said earlier, and this was so as to gain raw materials for the industries um, and market for their produce. So this then led to an unnecessary competition. There was a clash of imperial interest between the nations and ultimately this led to the outbreak of the First World War. The fifth cause is um, arms race. The European nations were competing in creating powerful weapons and powerful armies. Traditionally, we know that Britain had the best navy in the world, which was known as the Old Navy. Um, German then also began to build a strong navy uh, with powerful weapons to challenge what Britain was doing. So eventually, this led to the outbreak of the First World War. The second last reason for them. Um, the outbreak of the First World War is the Franco-Prussian War, which happened between the period of 18, 1870 up to 1871. So Britain had been defeated by Germany in this war. Because it has been defeated, um, Britain then started to seek for an excuse to go into a real war, which happened through the First World War. Lastly but not least is the Morocco Crisis. There was a serious rivalry between the French and the Germans on who was to occupy Morocco. So France was supported by Britain in this context and thus further creating more suspicion. We leave it here today. Should you have any addition, you can drop a comment in the comment section below. But don't forget to subscribe, like and share our videos.